Agent, can you hear me? Now, don't worry, the briefcase is safe. Do you remember what happened? Ah, uh, your memory might be a bit patchy from the attack. Well, take all the time you need. You're back at headquarters and you're perfectly safe. You'll find a tape on the desk in front of you. Load the tape into the projector console on your right. Now, I imagine you might recognize that bomb disposal device in front of you from your time as a cadet. In fact, it, given the wear and tear, it might be the same one. Well, I'm sure it still works. Now, let's see. How do I... Ah, yes, there it goes. Oh, just a bit further now. Right, disarm this bomb, if you would. <laughs> Wonderful! Yes! Next, the machine should dispense a grenade for you. Ah, there it is. Let's use it to test out that telekinetic implant of yours. Yes, exactly. Why don't you pick it up and bring it closer? Now, try using your telekinesis to, to hover the grenade nearby. Yeah, you've got it. Good, your telekinesis is still working. <laughs> I hear that when those things malfunction, it's usually very messy. Now to dispose of that grenade. Use your telekinesis to place it inside the black. Ah, good. Shut the... Yeah, you've got it. Good. <laughs> good. For your final test, you will need to dispose of three more explosives hidden around the examination room. Good luck. I left you a list so you know what you're looking for. I suggest you hover the clipboard nearby so you can refer to it as you conduct your search. Good work, Agent. You've passed all of the tests with flying colors. I've got just about everything I need. Don't worry, Agent. I've got everything under control. This could be you. Give all the world a stage. Let's set it on fire. So you'll be the spy and I'll be the liar. From the background, you can hear me. Highest billing makes a killing. They reveal me That beautiful mask you wear Is all I desire So you be the spy and I'll be the liar Face to face to face again And through the camera lens we ascend You're a minor part the major star ha! the credits are more than just the air 
Cause the truth is I despise you I will tear apart All these works of art That disguise you I'm making the final cut It's down to the wire So you'll be the spy And I'll be the liar I know this van isn't as luxurious as your old office, but we can't let Zoraxis know you survived your last mission. You've got a knack for putting a wrench in Dr. Zor's plans, so Zoraxis employees may not react kindly if they recognize you. On the bright side, now you've got a mini-fridge. As usual, Zoraxis Corporation is up to something vile and nefarious, but we haven't been able to figure out what. The Prime Minister is certainly making himself a target. Keep an ear to the radio agent. You never know what they might let slip. Now, your briefing materials should be arriving any second. Ah, where's that blasted courier? Aha! Speak of the devil. Take the cartridge from the tray on your right and load it gently into the cartridge viewer in front of you. Now, our intel indicates the Prime Minister is attending an event in Manhattan tonight. My instincts say Zoraxis will try something there, and my instincts are only wrong about half the time. Oh, and the event is hosted by Hollywood actor John Juniper. <laughs> oh, I'm such a fan. His performance in Marigolds of Forever was so... To confirm um, his stance on the new excuse me. Let's get you undercover so we can figure out what Zoraxis is up to. Marigolds of Forever... My instincts were right. This place is crawling with Zoraxis operatives. Now you're all set up backstage. Maintain your cover as a stagehand until you can find and disable the threat. I managed to snag a ticket to the show, so I'll keep an eye on the Prime Minister. You know, for a man who could launch 50 nukes with the push of a button, He's much more grandfatherly than I expected. Well, find out what Zoraxis is up to. Attention, stage crew. Today's the big day. If anything goes wrong with my play, well, remember what happened to that sound designer. Oh, we're almost ready to go. Keep an eye on your cue light. I'll turn it on when we're ready for curtain up.
Juniper's spotlight. That's John Juniper in the flesh. Oh, Agent Aya. Well, I'm sure you can handle things from here. Good evening, everyone. Now, I know what you're thinking. John, these tickets cost more than my yacht. This better be good. <laughs> I also want to take the opportunity to make a special announcement. I've got something new in production. I can't say too much yet, but I can safely say that you've never seen anything like it. For tonight, though, let's move on to the main event. I'm lowering the mask. Stage two team, get to your positions. Gas masks on. Oh, I do not like the look of that mask, Agent. Welcome, honored guests. We may Backstage live in team confirmed. Is there a leak in the gas container? This castle is solid. These strong walls what? and welded That's gates will seal us Seraxis away team. from the whole. Someone's tampered with the mask. We're moving up the timeline. This is not part of the show. Everybody run. I knew that voice was familiar. Agent, she's a Soraxis operative, known as the Fabricator. That is not an idle threat. Stay alive until I can get an evac team to you. Hey, the agent's on the catwalk. Those are Soraxis trained operatives. It's them or you, Agent. I think that's the last of them. I lost sight of the Prime Minister in the chaos, but I think he made it out. Uh, no sign of the Fabricator either. Well, let's debrief back at the van. Well, you did it. The Prime Minister's safe, and I hope John Juniper got out too. Although, well, something feels off. That stage manager, the fabricator, well, she's a nasty piece of work, but she doesn't usually take center stage in Zorax's plans. Very strange. <laughs> <laughs> 